What is the Hirschsprung's disease? Is an abnormal dilation of the colon that is not caused by mechanical obstruction. That affects the large intestine, colon, and causes problems with passing stool. The condition is present at birth, congenital, as a result of missing nerve cells in the muscles of the baby's colon. A newborn who has Hirschsprung's disease usually can't have a bowel movement in the days after birth. What is the symptoms? Abdominal pain. Bloating of the abdomen. Distension. Abdominal tenderness. Fever. Rapid heart rate. Tachycardia. Shock. Bloody or profuse diarrhea. Painful bowel movements. Factors that may increase the risk of Hirschsprung's disease include Having a sibling who has Hirschsprung's disease Hirschsprung's disease can be inherited. If you have one child who has the condition, future biological children could be at risk. Being male Hirschsprung's disease is more common in males. Having other inherited conditions Hirschsprung's disease is associated with certain inherited conditions, such as Down syndrome and other abnormalities present at birth, such as congenital heart disease. Hirschsprung's disease treatment For most people, Hirschsprung's disease is treated with surgery to bypass the part of the colon that's lacking nerve cells. There are two ways this can be done. A pull-through surgery or an ostomy surgery. How Hirschsprung disease is diagnosed Imaging can help diagnose Hirschsprung's disease. A plain abdominal radiograph may show a dilated small bowel or proximal colon. Contrast enema radiographs of the colon commonly are normal for the first three months of life and indefinitely in patients with total colonic disease. Pathophysiology the agonglionic segment remains in a tonic state leading to failure in peristalsis and bowel movements. Faces in the rectum fail to trigger relaxation of the internal anal sphincter, due to agonglionosis. The accumulation of faces in the rectosigmoid region is responsible for the functional obstruction, which is the cause of many of the symptoms. It can lead to proximal bowel dilatation which can present as abdominal distension. Increased intraluminal pressure can lead to decreased blood flow and deterioration in the mucosal layer. This stasis can lead to bacterial proliferation and the subsequent complication of Hirschsprung's enterocolitis, which has a mortality rate of 25 to 30 percent. If not recognized early this can lead to sepsis and death. Here we can see the enlargement of colon which is part of large intestine. Enlargement of colon and damaged the nerves. So here ganglionic cells are absent.